What's going, man? What's up? And welcome back to another video. We got another reaction video today. We're going to be doing a video by Chills called 15 Videos That Are Scary As Heck. If y'all want to check out the original video, make sure y'all check the link for, I mean, make sure y'all check the description for the link to the original video if y'all want to check that out. And let's go ahead and get into this one. Number 15, figure in the waterfall. Something lives behind the water here. A TikTok account shares footage of a mysterious figure captured at this Brazilian falls. Uma estranha aparição foi registrada por uma turista enquanto passa. It almost looks like a magic trick. Let's see if we can make out the sleight of hand. Here's a close-up. That bill looked pretty normal to me. The miniature figure ducks down behind the falling water. Like man I imagine escaping to its home beneath the falls. But what is this figure? I don't know for sure. Whatever it is, though, it's scary as heck. Number 14. Serbian Dance Lady. The Serbian Dance Lady strikes again. Currently trending in the Hindi-speaking YouTube community, I came across this image as a thumbnail on the YouTube channel Fahad Rai. I tracked down the original source of the video to TikToker Nika Els. The YouTube video didn't include the clip, so I believe the thumbnail is from the following Serbian Dance Lady video. She's just getting a little jig on and people want to record her. Just need to let people be, man. The lady's performance starts by clomping heavily down the street at night, and then, of course, she breaks into a dance. Dang. Hey man, why they why they hating on this lady dancing in the middle of the street, man? God forbid somebody just enjoy life and want to do a little dance. Now nah, now she's a creepy creepy woman on on YouTube. That's sick. Stop recording people. Let them be. Probably shouldn't have asked that question. Oh yeah, and see that's what you get, so they left I her alone. This is one of the scarier Serbian dance ladies out there. I've never seen one on the offense before. Number 13, Sasquatch Howl. What does a Sasquatch sound like? Well, you're about to find out. YouTuber Joe Bot Animations and more shares this footage of a sound he heard while checking on something outside. Listen closely. Not really hearing Do you hear real. it? He believes it's a Sasquatch howl. Some in the comments are truly freaked out. Oh, I hear that, man. But others think it could simply be wildlife. I don't know if it's a coyote or not, but I agree with those who say they wouldn't want to hear this while out in the forest, me included. I wouldn't let a noise bitch me up. I'm a grown ass man. It somehow sounds too close and far away at the same time. Number 12, Graveyard Investigation. While speaking to spirits through the spirit box, Redditor Project Purgatory TV and his team received some pretty clear responses. Well, we gotta be careful of. The spirit seems to know one of the team members personally. You know me. Is 
Did I just say my f***ing name? I didn't hear it. Yeah. What the f***? Yeah, we then warns demon. Jordan to leave. What the f***? Screw. I swear it just said Jordan is so funny. In fact, the spirit seems to be obsessed with Jordan. I swear to God, I was That's about what to I say. Heard it twice. It said it like, like two different. Oh, my people. actual name. Like a no. I heard I your first like. name. If I was him, I'd watch out. I think this spirit has become attached, and personally, I don't see that ending well. Number eleven. Haunted Army Camp. A military ghost is haunting this army camp. YouTube team Staffordshire Paranormal oh, Explorers yeah. shares this clip of paranormal activity during an investigation. Do you not believe that? Uh... What you're hearing is a door closing by itself. Listen again. Do you not believe that? Uh... I believe it. You couldn't ask for a creepier door closing sound because this sounds rather terrifying. I think this warrants further investigation into this haunted place. Who knows what could be uncovered? Number 10. Abandoned London Estate. YouTuber Connor of The Explorer Returns explores a London estate, but thankfully, this exploration is during the daytime. More he introduces ghosts, his audience right? to the estate. We're in. I'm saying he's trying to find ghosts, but honestly, if you run into an area like this, you're probably going to find more crackheads and homeless people than ghosts, bro. People would be squatting and living in places like that you need to watch out for people more than the paranormal in places like this an abandoned housing estate in london it's been abandoned for a very very long time some of them being from world war ii this is what these houses were purposely built for yeah world war ii is crazy abandoned since connor reimagines what it was like to be here just imagine all this all being really nice well kept the street lights coming on at night time and now, this is it now. It's been sitting unused. For Looks the past of apocalyptic. 45 to 50 years. The estate is so far gone that nature is taking over. The trees have like grown up a lamppost and sort of strangled it to the point where it's leaning over. That's pretty cool. I like and stuff like this. There, with a light hanging off it. A little lightning the place in the background is huge for added ambience. And all left to rot. Just look at it, look. Right here, right paid there, actor. another row down there. This is just mental. A massive estate like this, just abandoned. Although nothing jump scares Connor, ghost or human, the abandonment of this place makes me wonder what our presence will look like in the future. Just to show you the pure detail and to fully experience what I'm seeing right now. Like, look, look these would have been gardens. They've all got their own outhouse and everything. These are just insane, look, all around me. Will our homes and towns be left to rot? I think everything will be abandoned in the end. Number 9. Demon Encounter According to the homeowner, this home slash inn has been experiencing paranormal activity. YouTuber Jasko heads there with his friend Ben to see what they uncover. As Ben tours the place, he starts to hear noises. Oh, look, it's a buck. How was that? The slow ass turn. I don't know if you guys can see that right now. You heard the noise and listened. I guess it could have been for me walking. I guess, but these are kind of moving. She likes you. He continues through the home and Who's arrives at Siri? door number three. Tell her mind her business. Here we go. What the? F Hello. Onto the living room. He turns around and sees this. Watch the curtain on the right. That's the uh, left, buddy. What the f That's the left, bud. I was looking at the right side of the screen and almost missed it. After hearing subtle noises, Ben walks past the curtain again, but somehow doesn't notice this. What, what did we miss? Oh, I keep on hearing sh Hello? 
Why is he alone? I mean, he don't got no friends. I think there's definitely something in why. this house, and it seems to be lashing out Ooh. around every corner. Number eight, haunted castle. Castles are haunted for a reason because evil can reside there. YouTuber Adam Ghost Trapper explores this medieval castle that was built atop a Nordic pagan temple of Freya. They enter a chamber in which witches were kept prisoner and it makes them feel uneasy. This is a oh, yeah. one of I would never go nowhere where witches been, were kept. That's kind of crazy. Where the witches been captured. It's for sure. Witches be cursing lands and shit. That's crazy. That. They be cursing families for generations. The room they be cursing is a scary land. chamber. There's no Not go in there. Probably a bunch of curses built up, waiting to be released yes, upon it's, the world. It's stones everywhere. It's made of. It's it's a death chamber. You cannot get out of this place. Infected with a human sacrifice. Something shuts them inside what? of here. What? Did y'all just hear that? He just said it was a human sacrifice so casually. And he's still there, recording, looking, analyzing. That's so crazy. He said that so casually. What, like, what? Yeah, this human was sacrificed. Who what? The door? What was it? Looking outside, Adam sees someone. I think I see somebody. Suddenly, dark all sounds gone. Then he hears this strange noise. Oh. What was it? Somebody gets called it off. He finds a blackbird in one of the chambers. Is it a bad omen? Definitely. It's a blackbird here. Yeah. It doesn't afraid. It's just sitting there. Oh yeah, you're a crazy man. Or is this the spirit of Freya? I don't know what it is, but I don't think this is what's been shutting doors and making noises. That's a whole other beast. Number seven, human remains. This cemetery has been neglected and YouTuber Franco Travels is here to give it some attention. He finds some caskets with interesting features. And if you look here, that little knob on the top, you could just push that open just to see the face of the relatives if you want, but I'm not doing that. As he yeah, decides do not shit. to, he hears that. a voice outside. That would be disrespectful. I can respect what he's doing. I'm definitely more for exploring the paranormal someone. during the I daytime. I heard someone too. In People one doing tomb, he finds but something but creepy. People that explore during back. the nighttime are crazy. We do that shit when you can see. So if you look at the wall, it looks like something, some blood in there or something. Which is interesting because if there's blood in there. What are biohazard materials doing in this old tomb? Is this tomb being used for something unsavory? Probably I believe it might site. be. And the voice we heard earlier makes me think that Franco is being followed. Number six, well, Kings we'll Park know. Hospital. The late 19th century Kings Park Hospital is considered one of the most haunted hospitals in the USA, and YouTube team Charm City Paranormal is here to investigate it. They ask the spirits to set off the REM pod, and they comply. Is that you? Is that you that set off the REM pod? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. I might hurt you. When they ask them to do it again, this time it sets something else off. You do that again? Could you come into the room and walk by that device and set it off, please? I did. Oh, am I going off? That's a right? Yeah. As they continue through the place, they capture a disembodied voice. And those windows over there. You were on that somebody, side? I saw somebody walk past these windows right here. These windows right here. These windows right here. What the f is that? What? You didn't hear that just now? No. You saw somebody walk across here? Later, they're walking through a dark hallway when another EVP is heard. Who's coming? Satan? You better 
Better run. They head outside where they capture another subtle EVP. I like this. This ghost is a freak. He's coming. I like and this. And once ghost back inside, freak. they freak hear another. Ghost. This one kind of sing songy. I thought I was supposed to be looking for some. I get a really unsettling feeling in this place, and throughout the video, I keep hearing voices and wondering if they're really there or in my imagination. Number 5. Woodlawn Estates The abandoned haunted mansion of Woodlawn Estates has many secrets. The home turns brothel turns nursing home has a dark history that led some of its former residents to remain inside its walls long after passing away. The YouTube team Paranormal Quest is here to investigate, and it's not only the paranormal they'll have to deal with. Damn, man, what the fuck just happened? Just touched his ass? It never fails. Man, I got touched by the Holy Spirit. As they're getting ready to leave the cameras inside, they hear footsteps. Alright, one more thing, go, guys. The cameras capture unexplained noises inside the haunted fortress. Probably just a house settling. More unexplained movement occurs 10 minutes later, and one of the devices on the stairs is triggered. All right, so so question, question, right? Haunted houses, right? They they're known to like be abandoned nobody be living there and and you'd be hearing all types of shit right so what if since these places are abandoned right the houses are slowly rotting from the inside out and what you are hearing is the house slowly breaking down would that make sense or or grip Oh. Is someone here? When they re enter, they capture an EVP. Oh. Where did you go? What was that? What? You didn't hear that voice? No? Whoa. I think that means there is someone here and they want to cross over. Number the four Skinwalker Encounter. This skinwalker encounter in a creepy Nevada mine would have me sleeping with my eyes open. The channel Black Collar Project uploaded this to YouTube Shorts. Crazy, the man. people in the video are first warned by a scream. As they wander deeper, they think they must have been mistaken until this happens. Oh, there's something in this mine. Yeah, y'all disturbing its peace. Is it a skinwalker? I think it could be some other type of cryptid, but skinwalkers are a good guess too. I did some additional digging and it turns out this video is from film director and writer Danny Donahue, so that means this video is fictional. So although we solved this mystery, this video is still certainly terrifying. Number well, three, in a list Cobbs Hill fake? Cemetery. While on a paranormal tour of Cobbs Hill Cemetery in Barnstable, Massachusetts, Redditor Standard Help 5203 captured this creepy EVP. Listen closely. What was your pet's name? Nothing. Redditors are hearing different things. What was your pet's name? All of these interpretations sound valid to me. But personally, I hear Muffin. 
What do you hear? Number two, unusual pixie behavior. A lone pixie is behaving unusually in YouTuber Erwin Saunders' enchanted landscape. See us or not? What's interesting about it is that they, they, he's on his own, and there's no settlements up here. The nearest one I know is. Bro, why we never get so good? He got this good 4K camera, but he can't capture a good video to. of this mythical thing. Maybe this one's just a loner. I bet. Erwin gets a closer look. Just oh, he's just gone. Like, come on now. The, he got this good 4K camera. As they continue camera. to follow the pixie, it starts but picking that shit flowers. Looks trash. You can't really see him. You just see those gorse flowers there. The pixie then hauls the flowers down the hillside. He just went down there. That's why. It's got to be Camera quite quick. Camera shaky. All of a sudden. All of a sudden, the pixie blurry. What is this right. pixie doing with its bouquet? I think it's traveling to another settlement to woo his love. Either that, or making a flowery home to live in. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, no the life into Venice of Dark Life arrives at the village of the dead to find it very much alive with paranormal activity. He hears this sound outside. Sound like a crow. Probably just a bird, right? Or it could be this demon inside warning him to leave. A steady cam captures some loud banging noises in one of the rooms. So, you know, that's not the house settlement, I'll tell you that much. And it also captures this semi transparent figure lurking about. Nigga, the figure moves the across the upper landing and toward the stairs. So what the sound was. Figured it out. He just ran up the stairs. As Dennis explores one of the rooms, he is chased outside by something terrible and unseen. Don't be pussy. It's not even nothing back there. Don't be coochie, bro. Scary as hell. He thinks he's escaped it, but it's not over yet. Nigga try to jump out the window. Scary ending. Something is unwelcoming in this village. It seems to me the spirits really don't want the living here. You have to watch these videos until the very well, I hope that y'all enjoyed this video, man. If y'all did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, share all of that good stuff. And peace, love, and positivity, and I will catch y'all in the next one. It's two options in this world. Is you gonna win or lose? Is you gonna take the risk or not? You know you gotta choose. Yeah, I can't keep one, so all my bitches come in twos.